Namaskaram. Today we will talk about using Ayurvedic Dravyas that are available at home and about practicing Ayurvedic rituals that can be performed while you are home quarantined to fight COVID-19. For this, we will need to maintain a healthy environment, body as well as a healthy mind. But we need to note that all these procedures are supplementary to the general protocol of precautions that has to be followed by everyone. We will get this under the WHO guidelines. Uh, then ways to protect yourself from the COVID-19 infection. We need to understand first of all that prevention is the smartest management. According to Ayurveda also, the first line of treatment is always Nidana Parivarjana. For communicable diseases, Acharya Sushrut talks in Nidan Sthan 5 that Prasangat Gatra Samsparsha Nihishwasat Sah Bojanat Sah Shaya Asanat Chapi Vastram Alyanu Lepanat. He says intimate contact, touching, or breath of an infected person, sharing of food, sharing of bed and space, sharing of clothes and products of an infected person is totally contraindicated. Then we will talk about strengthening of our immune system because this is an infectious disease. An immune response of host is vital for prevention as well as re resolution of COVID infection. Then we need to be strengthening our respiratory system because Schwarzkas that is dyspnea, coughing and sore throat are closely associated to COVID-19 infection. We need to be improving our circulatory and digestive system because diarrhea, that is atisar, nausea, hilas, and vishamjur, that is fever, are also closely related to COVID-19 infections. And the people who have comorbidities like diabetes mellitus, asthma, hypertension, need to strengthen their systems as well because they are high-risk patients. Then we can do this by ahar, vihar, and oshar. First of all, Ahar, that means diet. We need to have a properly cooked diet because that inhibits microbial growth and it's easy to digest. Then we have to take a sattvic home cooked bhojan because uh, home cooked food is hygienic, it's clean, and it will enhance our immunity. Then we need to have lots and lots of cow ghee because it will uh, enhance our oja, that is, vyadi shamatva shakti of our body, that is, our immunity. Then if we can take, we can take goat milk because it enhances our immunity, it strengthens our respiratory system as well as our circulatory system. We can also take raisins and dates and other dry fruits. We can take garlic, onion. Then there are a few dravyas that you can take either uh, in your food or you can make a drink in the morning and take an MC, empty stomach. That are haridra that is turmeric, tulsi that is basil. Then you have uh, marish that is pepper, shunti that is uh, ginger, then you have peepli. You can also add nimbu to it because it is a rich source of vitamin C. And do take Indian gooseberry because it is highly rich in vitamin C and it will enhance your immunity. Now we will talk about vihar. Uh, we need to maintain a healthy environment. So Acharya Kashyap was a pediatrician. And children's immunity is weaker than ours, so he maintained a healthy and a protected environment by dhupan karm or fumigation method. The materials that we can use in dhupan karm are grit, that is cow ghee, we have haridra, turmeric, we have sarshap, yellow mustard seeds, we have vidang, tej patra, tulsi pushp, we have hing, we have gugul, chandan, ela, that is shuti, lychee, we have soft and karpur, we can also use neem. Uh, leaves and uh, or powder so we need to keep uh, any of the following materials that you'll get get in a tawa pan we need to heat it from below and we need to you know use the fumes that are liberated to cleanse and to disinfect your environment then you can also use mantra uchalan therapy it's uh, basically based on the principle of E is equal to mc squared so the sound energy that you produce will heal your body and your mind uh, then you can also use yoga early morning surya namaskar of about 
30 to 45 minutes will accumulate vitamin D in your body that is really good to enhance your immunity you can also take vitamin D supplements then there is pranayam you can uh, do pranayam to enhance your immunity to strengthen your circulatory system to improve your uh, oxygen carrying capacity then there is uh, dhyan then while you take a nap you go to sleep you can sleep in shavasan position because it really uh, calms your body and calms your mind meditation is good for calm calming your mind and for combat combating anxiety of any type uh, then you can have kaval uh, that is oil pulling it will cleanse your oral mucosa then we have few oshadis that are medication that will in, improve your immunity they are known as immunity modulators they are giloy you can use giloy quat you can use giloy ghanvati you can use ashwagandha choom you can use kutki you can use chavan prashavle you can use brahm rasayan this brahm rasayan is not just a good immunity modulator but it will also calm your mind it will you know it combats chronic stress so uh, Brahm, Brahm Rasayan is for a go because uh, people are getting really panicked about COVID-19 infection. Then you can also go for uh, strengthening your respiratory system by taking Pushkar Muljoon, Dash Muladi Kwad, Vasa Avle. If you're not able to go to the pharmacy, you can just take Ardrok Swaras, that is ginger juice. You can use it with honey. Then there is circulatory system enhancers. You know, you can purify your blood by using Mahamanjish Tadikwad, Kutki and on Nim. So stay safe, stay protected. Thank you.